Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Cooked by Motile. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. First, a big shout out to my returning subscribers for coming back. And if this is your first time here, you're welcome. Please consider watching other videos and I hope you get to enjoy this video and others. Let's make an omelette French toast. Let's go. I start by thinly dicing an onion. I'm using half a uh, medium onion. All the ingredients will be in the description box below. Please make sure to check. Then I'll grate half a carrot. Then I slice my green pepper into small cubes. Once that is done, combine all the ingredients, that's the carrots, the green pepper and the onions into a bowl. Next thing to add is the eggs. I am using two eggs. After I add my eggs, I'm going to slice my coriander and add to all the other vegetables and the eggs. It's important to ensure your vegetables are in the smallest size possible. In goes the salt, then mix, mix, mix and get ready to prepare the bread. I am using white sliced bread. You can use any type of bread, it works the same. So I'm going to cut the inner part the white part and remove it as you can see in the video. Then heat your pan and add a little oil. Take your eggs and vegetables mixture. Um, take the outer part of the bread, soak it in the eggs and then place it face down in the pan. The part that you've soaked in the eggs, that's the part that faces the pan. And then you're going to fill the empty part with the eggs, just like I'm doing in the video. Cover the medium part with the bread that was sliced out, then spread some eggs and vegetables on top. This should all be done within one minute. We don't want to burn our toast and remember to keep your flame on medium. So flip your toast and cook the other side for one minute. You can see our toast is looking uh, nice and golden. It's very soft. All the eggs on the inside are cooked. So after one minute, remove the toast from the pan and repeat the process. Look at that golden color. How good does that look, guys? How good does that look? Your bread should be crunchy on the outside, very soft on the inside. It's like a pillow on the inner side. You can make this for breakfast or for snack or when you want to um, wow your guests or just wow yourself. I enjoyed mine with some fruits for breakfast. Thank you so much for watching, guys. See you in the next one.